Hi everyone. Kes Make My YouTube channel. Welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I'm gonna be talking about the Clay Rains videos. So I'm, how I do this is simple. For those who are returning Mac Pass, welcome. If you're new to trying to watch this for the first time, welcome. Um, all I got to do is I go through the plays, I go through how the roll is. I'll let you guys, once you give it up, I'll let you guys talk about it and let me know what you think. But medical subs, um, and it's a twist to this as well. Um, if a player comes off, for example, a quarter time, I'm not going to be as harsh on him, on them because, you know, unfortunately, you know, I expect him to get injured. But I, I just want to say, um, Travis Bell, 300 games. Congratulations, mate, if you're watching. Should have mentioned that in my review video, but it's not too late. You know, good win last night, mate, for you guys. Um, you're a better team than us. Um, that's all. That's all I'm going to say on that. So, Rothfield, Crona, and Mayna. It's hard with Rothfield because of the way that he goes about this. Um, you know, certainly does try his hardest out there. Conceded four goals. Unfortunately, that's something's not his own doing as well. Um, at times, it's got to get better. I'm going to give him a 7. Um, only because, like, he, he gives everything that he's all. He does take him so marks. Um, you know, certainly, for me, he's one guy that you want to come out the ground with and, and really show improvement as well. Quayna, mate, he just shows up. He shows up, um, does a really good job. Um, I'm gonna give him an eight for that. I just think now it's it's not finals or buts for him, um, but I think it's what you need to do for him. Playing him, I think, helps. And I think the performances as well on top of that. As tough loss as that is, um, yeah, it's something that I wanted to talk about while I got the chance. Um, Crane always goes out his hardest. Made up 26 disposals, mate. He goes hard at it. One thing I like about Maynard is... If he makes mistakes, he likes to rectify it. Like, uh, like he, he's hard on himself, but then he wants to, you know, clean the ball up as well. I'm going to give him an 8 for his game. I thought he really showed me, you know, once again why he deserves to be um, in his team. Because he shows off why that he has to play um, as well. Terhill, Martin and Jack Cripps. Jack Cripps had a good game. I'm going to give him a nine. Um, the reason for that shows the leadership. One one seen him playing the midfield as well when Penderbury went down. Yeah, you know, a left footer who can who who can attack. You know, I'm going both sides of the body um, as much as possible. Tell Hill, I thought. He showed some signs in this game. A um, couple turnover kicks. Other than that, he will be dropped this week, and they, and, and and we'll get how back for that. But tell you he showed something. Um, signs are ahead for, for the young kid. He's an Irishman. Shows how important he is in his team and the future um, if he does stay. 
so it's good to see him get a fair crack. Um, I'm surprised we didn't play him against Carlton as well. Uh, wouldn't mind seeing that, but shows what he can do. I'm going to give him a six and a half for his game. I thought he shows quality. Could have him a seven, but Karen said that. I think it's a good result. Um, it, it, he'll, he'll learn. He'll learn. I imagine I'm going to give him an, an eight and a half for that game. I thought he showed why he deserves to keep his spot. Um, it's not easy. Um, there's a lot of imagine um, bashes in the scene. I'll put my hand up. The times where he does frustrate me as a fan. And the reason why he does frustrate me as a fan is because he can turn the ball over. You can kick a goal, but then turn the footy over. And once he turns the footy over, that's it. Um, you know, that's our problem. But eight and a half, I really like this game as much as possible. Um, to be playing more often. Now, Noble, Dugowie, Polter. Dugowie with an eight and a half. Really great game for him. Um, Show something the reason why that he does do is that he can do some great things. And he's been more matured as well. Normally you can see him kicking a goal, but he does like to centre it and give off to his teammates. Um, that certainly helps me as a fan because sometimes I want to see him kicking a goal when we got no choice. Um, but my main thing is if he can have a shot and kick it, go for it. If there is a play in the corridor, kick it. Give it off. Um, I thought he was really good. Um, Polter oh, keeps showing me seven and a half for his game. Definitely will get better and it, he should get better. Um, other than that, yeah, we're going to love it. Um, the future is bright for him. The future is bright. And Noble. Alright. I'm going to give him seven and a half. Yeah. Um, that's all. I think. I, I think with this. I see what he's doing. Like, I, I know exactly how he's going to play. But the future is certainly really good for him. I think, yeah, he's an absolute gun. He's, he's going to try really hard to play as well. Why not when you're that impressive? Um, but we need to keep playing him more often. Um, definitely how I think as well on top of that now Grundy, Canterbury and Adams now the reason why I'm skipping and not the forwards because um, I still part of the infield I think um, Grundy I'll give him a seven and a half um, close to an eight but that can change as well on top of that. And I think he does show you on what he can do and how he wants to play. Um, simple as that. So I know what we're going to get out of him. But it, it is what it is with that. Pendles got injured. Um, we had about five or six disposals. In the first quarter or two inside 50s. Um, he would have had more um, with that. So it started off well before he got injured. Um, I, I think he would have had about a seven game, but I'm not going to judge him. I'm not going to 
give a rating. Um, his season's over anyway. So, I oh know it's so hard for me to give a rating because, again, like the first quarter he came off, that sort of, di that didn't help in the end. Um, as much as anything. Tal Adams was a bit quiet in the second half, Dick Coppernock. First half, he was really good. I'm going to give him a five for passing up for that. Um, even though he had 24 disposals, um, you can have a good first half if you can't keep that momentum going. Um, it does hurt. So that's why I'm giving it as a pass mark. But that can change in the comments below as well. Now, Given in, um, Cameron and Bianco. Given in got his first touch. Um, like, he, he shows why he can play. And I think that's a more positive sign that he's given me hope that he can play. Um, didn't kick a couple goals. But one thing that he does do is that he senses the moment on what he can do. And I like that. Like, he shows some good signs. He doesn't need to have a lot of the footy. Um, but having said that, I'll give him, I'll give him a six. Yeah. I'll give him a six. That can change, but it's his first game. Um, look, I can be hard, but he did show me something. The fact is that, you know, that he, he can set up his teammates, he can get the ball himself, and trying, you know, when you set up um, my check, as much as possible, so absolutely gonna love that. Darcy Cameron, I, I, I think he tried. It's about seven, in my opinion. Um, that can filter down as well. No, either way, it's not gonna matter what. what. Yeah, it's up to you guys as well. Um, but yeah, not not good signs that I would have preferred him to, to dominate as well. Um, certainly how I think on top of that. Bianco, mate, what a goal. Seven and a half, I'll give him. How's that? And Elliot Mitrek, so bottom. So bottom, a six. I think he can show something when it comes to form, um, but comes across for me, he, he's a lot slower. But, um, you know, it is what it is with that. As well, um, my check probably goes three. Could have kicked five. I'll give him a seven. Um, other than that, he does show something which is good. Um, but it's another time. Jamie Elliott played his role really well for you, man. Eight. Certainly good signs for that. Now the interchange, McRae, Roscoe, Henry, Murphy, M McRae, a seven, showed something on how his role is, certainly needs to improve the more games he has, but other than that, he showed me something as well. Roscoe was good in defence, kicked the ball over a couple times, seven. 
So seven's not bad. I actually like it. Um, Murphy. And eight for this game. Yeah, I think. It's a few extensions that uh, I have with this. Um, plays really, certainly does play really well. Yeah, it does show a reason why. Um, other than that, yeah. For that, Mason Cox. I would not like it. Um, kick one, go one. I think he had like five or six disposals. He did show some signs that I did like. A six. He didn't play well, but a six. Um, you know, I would not have played him personally, but yeah, it's tough. It's tough as a Magpies fan, um, but we'll get through with it. So, West Coast next week. Um, recap of the round 18. season, sorry, um, on Monday, hopefully, um, whew, um, more videos coming out next week. And then I've got more videos coming out after that. Um, during the off season, um, I'm going to be getting more content up for you guys going through as well. Um, definitely, how I think that will happen. And as usual, 97 subscribers. I had a couple last night. Um, so, yeah, I'm close to 100, um, as usual, let me know what you think in the comments below, anything needs to be changed, um, we can adjust it, um, at the end of it, I am going to do a play range video end the season review um of the season what i think i'll let you guys have your say on that um i'm gonna try and live stream more avl content as well as much as possible um but until then like comment subscribe tell your whole friends tell your whole family Go the Mighty Pies. And may I give a shout out, Hominoz, mate. You've been the star, mate. Um, good banter. Next, you want to keep that going. Go the Mighty Pies.